Hello and welcome to another video here from Cebu City. Today we are in IT Park, which is the business district of Cebu City. And as you can see, we've got all the high buildings and it looks like we are in a different, in a different country. It is uh, so spacious, not that many people on the road and it's very nice and clean. A very nice vibe and it looks perfect to just chill and hang out as those guys just sitting here on the grassy area but our business in the business district is another we go in for food again so we go in to what was the name again Sukbo Mercado I think if I pronounce it right is the name of the food market so we're heading down this way and I'll bring you in once we're there. Here we go everyone, the entrance to Super Mercado. Food heaven. Let's see what we can get, how much we can eat. Let's try to make it a little challenge. Let's try to spend $50 on food and see how far we go before we're too full to continue eating. Hi, Hi how are you? <laughs> the name of my vlog? Yeah. Sim Sim Sam. That's your FB page? Uh, my uh, YouTube, my YouTube, YouTube channel. Sim Sim Sam. Sim Sim Sam. Sim Sim Sam? Yes. Ah, okay, okay. We'll look for that. Thank you so much. <laughs> enjoy your, enjoy your evening. You, uh. Thank you. Thank you. Alright, let's look around. Hello. We've got the sweets. Chicken skin. That is something I always wanted to try. I've seen it on a couple of stalls before. So let's go right for it. Hi there. How are you? Can I have some chicken skin? Small size? Or Small size, yes. Just want to try. How much for the small size? 120. There we go. Keep the change. That's fine. Thank you. Are you vlogging? Yes. Yes, vlogging the. Nice. How do you pronounce it? Supo Mercado, is that correct? Yeah, That's correct. Okay, awesome. Yes, uh, big food tour tonight. Yeah. Right, they've got beef steak, pork steak. Thank you so much. Butter, garlic, shrimps. So a lot of things. Let's see how much we can stuff in. I didn't eat a crumb today. That is my first food, literally. I saved it up for for tonight so the sweets coming later we've got ice cream mango all right let's try the chicken skin first all right guys look at this nice crisp up chicken skin i can't believe it it's it's like the best part of a chicken that you always keep till the end and now we've got a whole little bucklet full of it some vinegar to dip it in as well mm. it is not like the chicken skin that you will have on your chicken it is more like like a crisp very dry very crispy but a very good snack. It's our first thing done. We've eaten up the crispy chicken skin and heading towards our next food store. It's a pretty big market in terms of food because there's so much variety, so many options. It's gonna be hard to decide, but I wanna go for the more meaty and bigger bits things that you wouldn't eat every day so it's pretty international as well you've got takoyaki some smoothies again fruit 
some Indian cuisine. Oh, that looks so good. So you've got pork barrel steak and rib eye steak. That looks amazing. Comes with a serving of rice. I think we should get one of this. Hello. Hi sir. Can I get a pork barrel steak? Your name? Sam. Only one. Only one please. One hundred fifty. Thank you. There you go, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Please come back. 15 minutes. 15 minutes? Yes, sir. All right. All right, we've got a waiting time. It seems to be super popular because we have to wait for 15 minutes, so it means a lot of people are waiting for their food. Hi, how are you? Uh, so people are waiting for their food, so we've got 15 minutes to spend and uh, grab some food somewhere else. Let's see what else we've got. We've got sugar cane juice. Oh, we're definitely gonna come back later. I'll be coming back, you've got sugar cane juice? Oh, let's get one now. I'm thirsty actually. Fresh sugar cane juice? Okay, how much is one? This is, a, this is my bestseller, sir, plain and mingo. Just a, I want just a plain. Okay, what size, sir? I'll go for the big one. A big. All right, our first sugar cane juice. Am I right to, wa to watch? Can I have a look? Yes, sir. Oh, cool. So she's putting the sugar cane down the press, coming out on the other side. As you can see, nice and fresh. And the juice just going down the pipe getting filtered and straight into the jar as fresh as you can get it amazing thank you so in the future we'll be able to see some of the old school machines big and powered with with fuel and you will see the process of the sugar cane getting crushed Is it possible to get it with no ice? Uh, yeah, no ice. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I, I just want to down it like this, yes. So we got no ice, so we can just drink it and continue our way. How many do you put in there? Uh, ten, sir. Ten? ten? Yes. All right, ten, ten sticks. That should produce a nice load. Look at this. Wow. Oh, we're getting a lid on. Okay, we won't be able to down it like this, but that's okay. <laughs> But this is double portion now, right? Huh? This is double, double the portion, right? Yes. Okay. There you go. Uh, 95 now. 95. 95? Yes. But it's double now, right? Sir? You made it double. No, 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 no. 95%. Okay. Thank you. Yes, sir. No, that's fine. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. All right, thank you so much. Thank you. All right, let's find a place to just sit down and drink it. It's nice and warm as you can see. Hello, how are you? Hi. All right, there's, there's not much space. It's actually quite busy as you can see. All right, let's go back to one of the standing tables over there. So I think she put like double double the amount in the cup because I ordered with no ice and she only charged me 10, 10 pesos more. I wanted to give more but she didn't want to. 
Hello. Yes, sir. No chicken. Let's see. I probably won't be able to open it like this. I need to <laughs> go back and grab a straw. I forgot the straw. Thank you. Can I give that to you? Thank you so much. All right, here we go. Fresh sugar cane juice. Just on the corner on the market here. So sweet but refreshing. And it's a very good sweetness. It's the first time I drink sugar cane juice. I never had that before. And I really like it, but I have nothing to compare it to. The taste. Fruity and sweet. I'm so bad at explaining sometimes. good Whew. all right let's grab another snack hello let's grab another snack oh I see some bone marrow oh yes that is definitely my thing can you get it on its own no are oh, there so you have to get it with something Shushlabua, that's what we had yesterday. That's the pork brain. I'm always a fan of pork belly, so I think I'll be going. I'll be going for the bone marrow with the uh, pork belly. Hello, miss. Yes. Can I go for the high blood pork belly? You want to add the bone marrow? Yes, please. Plus 80 pesos. Okay. A total of 230, sir. 230. The exact amount? Uh, I try to make myself some change. <laughs> Hold on. Two. Sorry? Oh, thank you. <laughs> Did you see me sweating? That's okay, keep it like this. Thank you so much. <laughs> it is really warm. I'm sweating like crazy. The lady, thank you, gave me some. Tissues. How long? Ten minutes. Ten minutes? Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. The lady gave me some tissues because I'm literally dripping in between the food stalls. The warmth is like building up in here. There's no breath coming through. Okay, we've got two foods on hold. Let's see. If one is already good to go, but probably not. They said 15 minutes and it's been like five. So let's walk through to the other side and see what else we've got there. How you doing, sir? <laughs> so it looks like we've got some seafood over there. Lemon juice. Let's walk over and and give it a proper look. Hello. Let's see, we've got mango with shrimp. Go ahead, sir. We've got, I've seen that before. So mango, this mango, this type of mango is uh, sweet and sour and you can mix it with different kinds of things. So, I don't know which one is the one with the shrimp, but we'll go for that. Hello, how are you? We're fine, how about you? Good, thank you so much. <laughs> Can I get a regular uh, mango with a shrimp sauce? Yes. Awesome. What kind of sauce, spicy or sweet? Uh, I'll go spicy, please. Okay, 59 only. Do you have 9 pesos? Uh, no, no, it's okay, keep the change. 
sponsor? Yes. Uh, so this spicy? Yes, make it spicy, please. Okay. Also, this is gonna be a nice snack for our wait until our food is ready. So he places the mango, the sauce, and the spice in the bucket. <laughs> Thank you so much. He's giving it, giving it a good shake. So the whole mango is covered in the paste. Awesome, and he's gonna give it another big scoop of sauce. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. All right, let's find a place to sit down again. Hey guys, I'm all right to sit down. Yes, thank you. Okay, there we go. A little snack. So we've got the sweet and sour mango with a spicy shrimp sauce so it's tiny little shrimps and I know like back home you wouldn't go for mango with something spicy or salty even but this is a different kind of mango so it's um, the consistency is a little bit more hard and it tastes sour Such a good snack. So it's sweet and sour, it's a nice balance. And the mango itself has a nice little crunch to it. Mm. And it goes so well with the shrimp sauce. All right, all done with our mango snack. And off we go to pick up our food, hopefully. Thank you. Let's just, all the rubbish bins are of course right in the middle. Let's just get rid of our rubbish and grab our bone marrow. Maybe we go for our first order and check how far we are here. Order for Sam? Sam. Ready to go? Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Whoa, doesn't hold. Uh, it's okay. Let's thank go you. like this. Yeah, that's easier. Thank you. All right, let's slam that first. Let's find a little spot to sit down. Hey guys, am I all right to sit down here with you? Yes. Thank you. Okay. So we've got our little pork steak with a side of rice and some cabbage I assume. Alright, let's dig in and try this. So we've got nice fatty bits. Fatty, uh, bits. Mm. Not too overdone with the seasoning. Nice seasoning on it and grilled just to the perfect, um, to the perfect, how do you say that? To the perfect spot. <laughs> There's some sauce underneath the rice with the cabbage taste. It's got a pretty Japanese taste to it. Sweet and tangy sauce. We're done with our first meal. Let's go and pick up our second before it gets cold. I'll be right back. Keep my seat warm, all right? Okay, off we go. Well, that was a good little appetizer. But there's definitely room for more. Hey, sir. Belly. Belly with bone with bone marrow. That's mine. Awesome. Thank you so much. Oh, hand gloves. That's gonna be hard. Just put it on top here. 
Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. God bless. Thank you so much, guys. Whoa, don't lose the glove. All right, I got it. Cool, so we've got our pork belly with Bomber. I will show you that in a second once we're back at our table. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Thank you. All right, here we go. So our next dish on the list, we've got barbecued pork belly and bone marrow. That looks so delicious. I could probably go with a full plate of that bone marrow only. So while I'm slamming down my second meal, my neighbor is still chewing on her carbonara. I'll be probably able to finish like 10 meals until she's done with the carbonara. <laughs> All right, so good. We're back with the glove, my favorite tool to handle my food. So we won't need the cutlery. We go straight in with the hands. Okay, they kept the fat rim intact. So we're just gonna take bites because it's gonna be hard to rip it off. By far, my favorite so far. So good. It is a little sweet, nice and caramelized. Mm. Fatty and so rich and full of flavor. Then we've got the bone marrow. Looks like we've got some garlic on top, some chili. Let's dig in. Maybe we should get the spoon for this for this bit. Mm. Yum, yum, yum. It could use a little more salt, but it is amazing. Have you ever had this before? Yeah, and do you like it? Just say it, la mi. La mi. La mi means delicious, right? Yeah. Uh, I know more Tagalog. Do, do you know Tagalog as well? Yeah. Masara? Bisaya. Yeah, he is Bisaya. Masara. La mi, la mi. <laughs> so that is one thing I figured here. There's so many things that are definitely worth eating, that are so good that back home many people wouldn't consider food. They would throw it away, unfortunately. Yesterday I had at Carbon Market, uh, I had uh, the pork brain. brain. Choslo Buak. yes. That was so delicious, I really liked that. How was it Choslo Buak? Oh, like it? Yes, like I loved it? it. It was like my favorite my favorite dish on the whole market. Very good. It's really good that you try it because some foreigners didn't want to try it. Of when, course. When they, when they know try. it's a Balut. I had Balut, that was my first food on the market. Yes, of course. You like it? I'll take, I took the 18 days off. Oh my god. So <laughs> <laughs> old? Yes. Small one. <laughs> <laughs> Me, I just only eat 17. 17. 17. But 16. Is 16. 17 and 18 days a big difference? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit? Yeah, 18 is more. Oh, 18? <laughs> <laughs> I can eat that, I can. Yes. I tried all sorts of insects in uh, Cambodia and Vietnam. And it tastes good? Mm. So, she eats pig brain, but she gets afraid of grasshopper. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, huh. this is how different fruits are very different in different countries as well. So things considered normal here are abnormal somewhere else. Look at this guys, we finished everything up, it was very delicious, but there's still room for more and we're trying to complete our challenge. Thank you so much guys for your company, have a nice night and see you again. Thank you. Alright, let's head to the last corner we've been to, which was right over there. It's trying to get through. 
All right, we just went with some meat. But that looks very delicious as well. Uh, da, da, da. More steak, we just had steak, thank you. Hi guys. Right, some seafood, grilled pork belly. So we had so much meat already, let's go for something else for the change, but it's gonna be hard as meat is on display pretty much everywhere. Ooh, that looks pretty good. Let's go for some seafood. Hi, how are you? Hi, good. All right, look at that. We got filled squid. Oh. It's a boneless bangus milkfish. Very good. Yeah. What is this? It's really delicious. Sea grapes. Sea grapes. How do they taste like? It is like, uh, like I, I, I can explain. I should figure out, right? I will. I will try that. What else do we have? All right, big portion of fish. That looks pretty good as well. Okay, so I will, can I have one of the filled squid? Yeah, sure. Um, that one looks pretty good as well. Yeah, sure. You want that one? Yes. And I would like to try the sea grapes as well. Yeah, sure. How about some rice? Uh, I think I'll go without rice on this one. I had so much rice already. Um, is there anything else you should really recommend that I should that I should try? Um, or do I have the bad things? What about those? The scallops? Only big scallops, yeah. Uh, 110 pieces. 10 pieces? Yeah. Is that the smallest uh, size? Yeah, this one. <laughs> okay, okay, let's go for let's go for that as well. Okay. That's all three? Uh that's it, thank you. Okay. Only seven hundred. Okay, seven hundred pesos. Oh you forgot you want drinks? Like water Uh I would like a water, yes. One water? Yes, add a water please. Seven hundred twenty five. Thank you. Thank you very much. Awesome, thank you so much. Only 10 minutes, sir. 10 minutes? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, sir. All right, 10 minutes and we get our next load of food. A lot of seafood, fish, and some new things. I could use some liquid. Let's go and see if we can get a, a juice somewhere. Over there, that looks good. All right, what have we got here? Hello, sir, how are you? I'm fine. Ah, what's your best seller, sir? Yakult, cucumber, Yak and watermelon. Watermelon. Mixed with lemon. Watermelon sounds very good. I'll go, I'll go for the watermelon, please. What size? Um, let's go large. This size? Yes, sir. This one? Is that, is that large? Yes sir, and the other one is extra large. Uh, large, large is alright. Okay. So it's a fresh squeeze, we get the lemon squeezed. So as fresh as you can have it. And this is the basil. Basil? Yeah, nice. Juice. Watermelon. Is it juice or syrup? It's a juice, juice right? Yes. Pure watermelon. Nice. Want more ice? Uh, no, that's fine. Alright, topping the rest up with some water. Mixing it up and ready to go. Thank you so much. We have 25 pesos. Sir. Uh, just keep the change. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much. Enjoy. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. All right, here we go. Watermelon lemon juice. Hi. Try. Hi, sir. What's that? Chicken. Chicken. Right. It is. I want crispy chicken pepper. Thank Try. you so much. Oh, that's really good. Yeah, and we have all chicken. I just ordered a big plate of fish. Uh, if I have some space, I might come back. Okay, okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Okay. 
All right, let's try to already find a place to sit down. Our food will take about five minutes until it's ready to go. Hi, can I sit here? Is that okay? Yeah, thank you. All right, so we got a space. Just waiting on our on our seafood, and then I'll bring you back in. All right, if I heard correctly, our food is ready to go. Did you say 18? Yes. Oh wow, that is huge. Thank you so much. That is mine, right? So you want to do Uh yes, why not? Because it's not already enough. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. You want chili? Yes, I'll take it. <laughs> Thank you so much. Wow, look at this platter. So that was a full price of 725 pesos. I'm not too sure <laughs> we'll be able to finish that. I think we probably have to, oops, sorry, <laughs> to share some of the food maybe. I won't be able to finish that all unless it is incredibly tasty, which I don't doubt. So we've got our, I don't want to lie might be tuna but I'm not too sure actually then we've got our filled squid this one looks very good filled with fresh veggies I think he said sea grapes never never seen that before and he couldn't explain me how it tastes might must be a very unique flavor and our scallops all right let's just go and dig in and start with a Let's actually start with the fish. Mm. I don't know if you could see that, but I just need to touch it with my teeth and it's literally just falling off. It is so soft. The skin is nice and crispy and it's not dry at all it's such a succulent fish i don't think that this is tuna because it is way too juicy for tuna unless i've never had such a good tuna before Okay, then we've got scallops with I don't know what some sort of paste mm. it's just like a puree inside just next to it just a little bit here on the side but it tastes very metro actually very Like, like scallop with a little bit of flavor coming from the puree. Very nice. Okay, I'm very curious for those. I think you eat the whole thing. It's like a like a vegetable version of. Uh, fish roll. Very satisfying how they how they pop between your teeth. Mm. Got a salty salty flavor. Mm. Tastes very fresh, very very nice, a very refreshing food. Mm. Okay, I've only got a spoon, I'm not too sure. I'll probably have to go in with my hands for the squid. Or you can just pull them apart. Mm. 
I'm usually a very big fan of squid, but this one doesn't have much flavor to it. It looks very nice, but it could use some seasoning. So the squid is actually not my favorite of this one, but the fish is really good. The rest I really, I really like. Do you want to help me? It's okay, sir. Thank sure? you. I will be not able to finish all of it. <laughs> all right, I'm pretty much defeated. This is actually the first time I wasn't able to finish my food here in the Philippines. So we managed to go through all the scallops, but some fish, some squid, and some of the sea grapes are left behind. So I'll try and see if I can get it doggy bagged, and then we are finished for today, unless there's a little spot for something sweet in the end. Hey guys, that was really delicious. Do you, do you have doggy bag? Yep. Oh, amazing. I so can't much, finish sir. anymore. That was so good. Uh, thank you. What uh, what kind of fish was that? Uh, white marlin. White marlin. It was very good, very tasty. Yeah. So it was white marlin. That explains why it was so juicy and and fatty and rich. Really good fish. <sighs> but as you can see. The belly is <laughs> framing now. So we were able to get it in a doggy bag so we can enjoy some of that tomorrow. Maybe for breakfast if we're ticky. You want some chili? Uh, yeah, chuck some in, why not? And spoon. No, that's fine, no spoon needed. Okay. Thank, Thank you, you so much, sir. Have a good Thank night. Alright, let's roam through the last bits of the market and then we have completed our round maybe a few steps will create a little gap for something sweet in the end all right we made hi how are you i look for something sweet in the end to finish do you think yeah they will fill the last gaps before i burst our best seller is our signature chocolate, the Ubi Lava. Okay. So that's that's chocolate, right? Yes. And all right, I think I go with Ubi Lava. Ubi Lava. Yes. Only one order, sir. Yes, of course, only one. One thirty. One thirty. That's okay. No change. That's okay. Put it in the tip box. Thank you. I'm here for to vlog. Yes. Yes. I just I just started basically. Yes. So my my. It's Sim Sim Sam. Sim Sim Sam. Sim Sim Sam. Yes. One word, nine letters. Your vlog is all about food. No, about travel. But food is one of the main main components. How long? I'm not too sure yet. So far, one and a half weeks. But uh, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like maybe. It's a good thing that you came here. Oh, it's, a, it's, a lot such, of food it's here. such a good market. Yeah. And uh, I had a lot of food. A lot of choices here. I'm about to burst. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what, what have we got in there? So it's. Uh, we have the milk baser and milk then base? the ube. Ubi lava, the jam, ubi jam. Ubi jam yeah. as well. And then the ubi whip. It's all natural and then homemade. Right. But your drink is still open here, so you have to you, seal you it. You can first. experience to seal your own drink. Yeah. You just need to put it straight here. And okay. Then you press start button to seal your drink. Oh, wow. Okay, so the full experience here. Okay, yeah. just press start. And then it seals the drink. Yeah, it seals that is so good. cool. Yeah. But before you open your drinks, you make sure to shake it really well. Shake it well? Until like it's one color before you open. All right, here we go. So that goes really 100% natural. And they've got the Instagram page as well. So we make yeah. some, some nice promotion here. Thank you so much for your No worries. Thank you so much. Now you're welcome. Enjoy the rest of your stay here. Oh, wait. I'll, I'll, I'll start. I will drink it here. Oh. <laughs> you give a 
I have no I have no free hands anymore otherwise. Alright. I can open the fridge door, okay. I uh, got it. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Alright, there we go. So it's like a like a little can which is pretty cool. Yeah, soda can. So you've got you've got the milk ube ube jam and are they like um is it like jelly? No, I have no jelly. Baby. No jelly. No pearls. No pearls. What? What's that floating in here? Ice. ice. Oh, that's oh, ice. ice. Yeah. Oh my god, it's shining purple. That's why I'm so confused. That's a nice refresher. It's actually not too sweet. It's good. It's not too sweet. Nice and liquid. It's a very good finisher for the market. So if you come. Just right to the out. entrance or at the exit uh, de depending which way you want to go around um, so it's definitely to me it's a good finisher in the end all right this was us from Svukbo Mercado we finished our food challenge I didn't count so you'll find the total amount right down here and let's see if we came even close to the $50 we're full to the brim so we end this video here. Uh, thank you so much for watching and I hope I'll see you in the next one.